What's up guys, this is Andrew at night and today I'm going to show you how you can get the Sense 3.0 style lock screen on the Samsung Galaxy S2, as you can see here, and it's pretty cool, it's one of the things I most like about Sense 3.0, um, and it's actually really easy to get, all you need to do is go to the market, and I'll put a link in the description, and download Agile Lock, and then you can either pay, I think it's about 89p to unlock all the settings, or you can download three or four applications via this page um, when you have the free version there'll be like a little link here uh, you download those and then you get points and I think you need about 300 points which is like three or four applications and then that allows you to um, unlock the full version for free which is quite cool but uh, show it again there you go so as you can see there's a little bit of a timeout thing which is a bit like widget locker um, sort of after you've hit the home screen or after you've powered off so you do need to wait sort of four or five seconds otherwise it won't actually um, have sort of appeared yet but uh, when it does it works really well you drag around anywhere here and it'll unlock and then you've also got these four customizable buttons so for example I've got calling here which I drag in there and it launches you into calling and they are customizable in the full version and you've also got the options to change this animation so you see that pulls down you can, well, can customise everything, you can customise all the fonts, colours backgrounds, shortcuts but the coolest thing I think is the animation so you can have a default one see the little lag there there you go default one just unlocks it like that you've got fade Let it load. Yeah. Which just sort of fades it. And then you've got the ones that I really like, which are those swiping ones. And I had bottom I had top to bottom, but you can have sort of right to left, left to right. And I think they look pretty cool. So uh top to bottom is the one I was using. You've also got music control which doesn't work with Spotify, which is what I use, which is a bit annoying. But it's like all the other lock screens that have the music control on. Uh, and then you've got all these other settings which are all fairly small and you can play around with when you get the application uh, the one I did use is to stop the status bar or status bar I want to say it uh, sort of being pulled down as you can see it glitches a little bit but it doesn't actually pull it down which is quite good because it means you have to unlock the device to reply to an email, email or something so you can't do that in your pocket um, but yeah that's the Agile Lock, which is the Sense 3.0 style lock screen for the Galaxy S2, uh, and it works on any other device. So go to the market, I'll put a link in the description, check it out, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. And most of you are going to have noticed that I've got this on, I've also got it on the back and on the sides here, which is looking pretty cool. And this is the wraps that they've sent me to review, and I'll be reviewing that in a few minutes, so that should be up later today. See you. Uh -huh. Sorry about that. See you later. Ta-da. <laughs>